Hi, I'm Eduardo Rodriguez, and you're watching Trailers from Hell. I want to talk to you about a film that I lost count of how many times I've seen, a documentary called Baraka. And in case you wonder, Baraka is a Sufi word that means blessing. A challenge. A warning. A gift. A blessing. Baraka. I wish we could make this trailer from hell without saying a word, because no words can describe this visual masterwork. The only way to understand Baraka is to watch Baraka. I mean, just the logistical achievement of this movie is impressive. It was shot in 24 countries and 152 locations over a 14 month period. But the filmmakers went beyond shooting places and people and produced some of the most gorgeous and exquisite motion control time lapses I've ever seen. I know these days we take these amazing motion control shots for granted with our compact cameras and all the new CG technology. But back in 1992, they had to build a special 70 millimeter equipment to make these shots happen. And believe me, it was totally worth it. The results are beyond spectacular. And even almost 30 years later, Baraka's time lapses are still breathtaking to watch. Another visual staple of this movie are the close-up of people staring right into the lens. They almost look like mirrors, where you can look at yourself and your own reflection. According to producer Mark Maggitson, all the director did was ask people to look into the lens. That was it. You get these shots with a super simple technique. Director Ron Frick was also the director of photography of Baraka, and to his credit, he mostly used available light during the shoot. So when your DP comes complaining that he or she doesn't have enough gear to shoot in the kitchen, show them a few minutes of Baraka and tell them that they had no lights to create those images. I promise I'll take care of that argument. Ron Frick deserves all the credit for the amazing visuals in the film. But Baraka wouldn't be the same without Michael Stern's score. To me, if the visuals are the engine, the music is the vessel that allows you to make your own personal journey across so many places, cultures, and religions around the world. I don't want to sound like a shaman or a witch doctor, but Baraka can take you to a place of reflection and self-examination like no narrative film can. The power, rage, and essence of life itself.